gonna say nothing. I've just had to make chocolate out the afternoon calendar. You're gonna say goodbye to Madeline? No, not yet. Oh, what's the matter? Are you excited for another day at school? Yeah, yeah. Oh! You always get to stand. I know, he doesn't you? To see me go. There you go. He likes to stand on the windowsill, don't you? I've got you. Madeline's got you. Just wants a kiss? Oh, he's missing. Oh, he's ready. He's in position. We'll do a little dance together. All right. Have a good day, Madeline. Oh, yeah. Bye. Bye. Bye, Holly. I've got you. <laughs> I've got you. <laughs> this is your dance that you and Fred Madeline do, isn't it, on the way out the door? Bye, Madeline. Bye. Good kisses. Mwah. And again. Good boy. There she goes. Okay, so now we are going to get ready, aren't we? Yeah! even managed to get a little bit of a bargain with it as well which I wasn't expecting so I've just got back home feeling rather festive today so for lunch I'm gonna have a festive bake we did pop into Greg's on the way back um, Freddie's got a sausage roll but at the minute Freddie's refusing to come and eat it at the table so I'm sure he'll come through when he's hungry so I'm gonna have my and make myself a cuppa hi Freddie hello oh big noise Where's he going? Where's he going? <laughs> Bye! <laughs> and he's gone again. Right, and then, as I was doing yesterday, um, I sorted out one of my cupboards. Um, and it just, I just made it look like a little bit tidy and everything, and just sort of repositioned everything so it was a little bit better. Um, and today, there is a cupboard over here. Um, behind these doors, these very doors here, um, which we are going to tackle. Um, now this cupboard does actually stretch all the way along, sort of under the stairs. Okay, so it's um, it's quite a big job. Um, and I'm going in, so we're going to have lunch, and then I'm going to tackle that. 
um, and I, hopefully I'm going to get it done today because I don't want to drag it on. It's just one of those jobs, but guys, you're not ready for what a state it is in that cupboard. There we go, festive big and a black tea. Freddie's got a sausage roll, he's now joined we're at the table. Is it lovely? Nummy, nummy. Mm. Okay guys, we've had lunch. I've danced around with Freddie. I've tidied things up, I've put the washing on the clothes horse. I can procrastinate no more. It is time to go in and get this big job sorted. Now, this is what I probably would call my cupboard of shame. And um, basically it's the cupboard. I don't know if you guys have got one. Comment below and let me know. Have you got that cupboard in your house where you open it up and throw things in and shut the door and hope for the best? Well, this is mine, okay? Um, I'm not proud of it and the last time I got even any sort of clear out was last Christmas and that was just to make room on the shelf for all of the snacks and nibbles and chips and you know crisps and things like that. So I'm going in, okay guys? I'm not proud of this. Um, but I'm just hoping that I can make some progress and get it all sorted out. Are you ready guys? Here it is. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, exactly. Oh my goodness me. So I'm just going to move that. So you can see like this just, this is absolutely full. I'll probably use like sort of this tiny bit here every now and again and might get something out of those pink drawers but and shove some carrier bags in and hide some magazines in there that I didn't want out anymore but yeah that is the cupboard of shame but you see what happens is you close the door don't you and then you're like ah, it's gone but today no more it is going so this is the last time you're going to see this cupboard like this like on my hands and knees right at the back of the cupboard trying to get everything out um, I've had to take a little bit of a break because I've got a bit of a headache are you alright Freddy? are you doing? are you running? and he's gone <laughs> what are you doing? you made a mess that's what you're doing so I've definitely made some progress with the bottom now just at the back here I've got like sheets for putting down for decorating this is like um, packing stuff, like if you're sending letters, there's brown paper and envelopes and things. And then there's a bag here which has got birthday bags in. Okay, so I'm pretty much clear. Um, and if I just move back here. Hi, Freddie. Freddie's being mummy, aren't you? So I've got this set of drawers which is going to go in the bottom now, which I'll start to fill up with all the birthday, celebration, tablecloths, mommy, plates and stuff like that. Yeah, that's right. So, I've had this lampshade in the cupboard and I don't even know why I'm keeping it because mm -hmm. it's got a big hole in it. Yeah. So, watch your fingers. It might be sharp, darling. Good boy. So, we're going to have to take that and put it in the bin, aren't we? No, don't. Okay. Don't, Mummy. Alright then. Okay. It's not supposed to go in the bin. It's not supposed to go in the bin, isn't it, Nash? We, we right. put the lace in that. All right, okay then. Okay. I go higher, so higher, these higher. are Easter bags. Okay, now I've just been having a look. There's actually, there's actually chocolate eggs and things in this one still. 
So this is how much chocolate we get to in our house. So basically you don't Hi. even finish it all. Hi. Hi. So this is my bag of rubbish. And then... Tickle, 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 And then mommy, all of this here... Pardon? I will. Do get me the feather then. Pass me the feather. And then all of these bags here... We've got this one, got this one, this one. This is all carrier bags, so I need to sort this out because there's too many. Tickle, 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 tickle. Tickle, 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 tickle. So we'll just stand back. I mean, it just looks an absolute mess right now, doesn't it, guys? So what I'm going to do is just finish off in the bottom there. Um, and then move on to the top. So, I'm... Um, I'm getting rid of quite a lot of stuff. I think I've done quite well, to be fair. Um, but, oh my God, this headache. I don't know where this has come from. I've just taken some paracetamol and had a nice drink of water. So, hopefully... What are you doing in there? What have you found? Oh, man. Oh, he's found something in his bag that I was going to keep for him. Oh, wow. He's found a PJ Max egg. Have you now? Yes, I was going to try and keep that for you to have. Mm-hmm. I guess you're having it now, are you? Yeah. All right. Have you been a good boy? Yeah. You have, and you've stayed in your bed all night again, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah? That's fine. I'll finish I'll it. I'll it. Can have a look? Well, should we open it and see? Yeah. Ooh. PJ Masks. PJ Masks. PJ Masks. PJ Masks. PJ Masks. Okay. Okay, let's open the egg. Right, where's the opening bit on it? There it is. Ooh, are you excited? Ooh, that's it. Wow. Shall I pop it so you can? Yeah. Ooh, what have you got? Let's have a look. Freddie, what have you got? Whoa. What's the first thing in your hand then? Show me. Let me see. What is it? Don't know. Oh, I think it's some sort of little puzzle, I think. Yeah. I'm Can I show the camera a second? It's, yeah, it's some sort of little puzzle. That's I'm cool. Do that. And what have you got? Jelly beans. Yeah. Ooh, jelly beans. I'll open it. That's it. I think that is it open. And then you've got some more stickers. I can't open it. I'll open it. Ready? I'm not even sure what you're supposed to do. Like, wait, let's have a look. I'll catch you guys in a bit. So see you in a bit. Ready? Let's see your hat. <laughs> Love it. You look like the Pope. So you remind me of. Do do do. <laughs> choo choo. All aboard the Freddy Express. Oh, come on in. <laughs> if anybody's just tuning into this vlog now, they're probably looking at our kitchen, thinking, "Oh my goodness me!" But guys, can I just assure you, if you have just fast forward. To this point, I'm currently clearing out this cupboard. Okay, so don't think that this is like a normal occurrence. Come on, I'm asleep. Choo choo! Um, come on. Hi, I'm in. Choo choo! <laughs> come on, in the seat. Okay, we're going. Choo choo! I'll have to obviously stand up, ready. Oh. Looks like the train's going to be delayed. Go on, push through, push through. Go on, you can do it. Go on, Freddy. It's just bags, just bags. Go on. There you go. And the train is back on. I think I'll get this hat off the floor. Maybe put my slippers back on. And pick up the remnants from your... I mean, there's just a, a catalogue of Freddy on the floor, really, isn't there? Are you liking that? Choo-choo! Oh, oh! <laughs> And do you want to get out now? <laughs> Are you doing a flip? <laughs> I can't believe that it's taken me like three hours 
and um, sort this out but I'm done um, as much as I can do really because I do have to crack on and make some tea um, obviously Madeline's home from school now and um, she's just been entertaining Freddie upstairs for a bit which is really nice so it's not I can get on so I'll show you my progress I've made anyway so if you can see now um, I'll just we'll start with the, the top level so I've got all this nice space in here now um, it's not perfect obviously but I do have to store things somewhere um, so this is what we're left with today and then in the bottom here um, it's a lot more sorted out it's hard because the we're losing the light as well now so what I've done is I've introduced this um, three drawer section thing to go in there it's like just one of those plastic ones I had it in the room upstairs and I've put all of I've got lots of party stuff and everything kicking around obviously I've got to have my mops so this will have to go in there but what happened is all of the Christmas snacks and stuff will go in here to be stored there before they're eaten so I'm just pretty pleased the only thing that I haven't sorted and finalized is um, all of these carrier bags but I'll just sort these out after tea and then there'll be a bag of each can go in the bottom of that cupboard so that's it thank goodness I'm just about done um we'll have a nice clear out Miss Madeline she's got she looks like Santa she's got two sacks with her Ho ho ho! <laughs> ho 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 to the big men! <laughs> Are you doing well? Are you good? Yeah, Thank I'm you for entertaining Freddie for me while I got that cupboard done. Yeah, he was watching telly sitting on my bed. Oh, was he? Well. Just cleared out some oh, more right. papers and sort of the surface things. Yeah, excellent. I won't go into the drawers just yet. No. Nice clear out, ready for Christmas, ready for Santa coming. Do you want to see my cupboard? Do you want to yes, see mine? Yeah. Ready? Ta da! Let's see your face. Do you like it? Yeah. So as you know, like I like to have a nice space clear oh, yeah. for the Christmas snacks. So this year I thought they would the all go in here. So just be stored. I've put this in, the three drawer thing in there. Oh, That's yeah. got all party stuff and Ooh. buffet stuff. Hi Freddie! Hi, Hi Freddie with no jeans on. You're right. <laughs> Excellent. Right, I'm gonna get some tea made. Ooh, Everybody hungry? Yeah. Ooh, thank you. you. I've got some papers to put Excellent, in. okay. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Exciting. Is everybody hungry? Oh, yeah. Yeah, are you hungry? No. Okay, what have you been nibbling on like? <laughs> Nothing. And he's off. Go. <laughs> Way. <laughs> so, just keeping things nice and simple for tea tonight. Hey. hey. <laughs> we have got, my God, my hair is such a mess after being in that cupboard. I was like, literally, down on my hands and knees in the back of the cupboard. Anyway, I've just got a package of ready cooked, like ready. Is it ready cooked, would you say? Um, chicken, which I've had in the freezer, so I've just got out of defrost. And all I'm doing is just like pan frying it to heat it through till it's nice and hot. And it just gives it that little bit of, I don't know, an extra flavour, really, doesn't it, Madeline? Yeah. So, just done that with a little bit of fry light, so just kept it nice and healthy. Just going to turn that right down now. And then over here, we have got couscous in here, which is just couscous, which is just this one. Worldwide Foods, which I think is from Aldi. Yes, it is. And then that's just got hot water on, and then you just leave it for five minutes, and that's that. Um, and Freddie has asked if he can have a chicken wrap. So that's his wrap ready to go. There we are. So that's a really quick take. Like, literally, guys, if, if you need some sort of quick tea, that, this is it. Totally. This is it. There you go, set that chicken ready. It's only five minutes, fried the roux, nice and hot and ready to go, and that's it. Then all I do is, well, Madeline's busy getting them out, so I'll just get out of our way and then I get on. We just oh, we'll always keep up in the window, we'll always keep a plate up before we put the food on, because otherwise I find that the food just doesn't stay hot in your plate for very long. Also, guys, yeah, you can put it on for a minute now, thank you, Madeline. Also, guys, I am completely buzzing. I'll just turn it back around because today I found my Ted Baker necklace. Basically, for Christmas last year, um, I got like a pearl which I had to get out of um, a shell. Um, and it wasn't, you're not guaranteed they're actually going to get um, a pearl, but I did. Anyway, I remember now I put this necklace in the box that I got because it was a necklace that came with it in case you did get um, a pearl. 
in it and I remember now putting this necklace in that box but like I've been looking for this necklace for ages and I couldn't for the life of me remember where I got it from and so I'm really really pleased um because I've been looking for it for a long time so yay get in so it's been quite a good day cupboard sorted found my necklace Madeline sorted her room just about all good so we're just gonna have to go in there <laughs> you see that's just a vlog and fail isn't it We've just been talking about the things, sometimes the silly things that you say when you're vlogging and you don't even realise it at the time that you're madeline and then yeah. it's like afterwards yeah, when out, yeah. sometimes people point it out to you as well because you haven't even realised and then even when you play the clips back to put your vlog together for that day you're like, you like, you just don't even like hear it because you hear what you were meant to say um, that's quite it's funny. Like, it's like when you're writing and you need someone to proofread your work. Oh yeah, it's always be better to get somebody else to proofread it, isn't it? Yay. Right, excellent. Right, do you want to find, go and find the Fred stuff? Yeah. I'll get the dinner put out. Right, catch you guys in a bit. So there we go. So piled high with chicken on roasted vegetable uh, couscous. Madeline, what do you reckon? It's Looks really good. Nice. Yeah, I was about to take a mouthful. Ah. <laughs> I can't couscous. No, it, it's not couscous, darling. It's called small rice. It's mini rice, mm -hmm. isn't it? It's. Mmm. And you, you've got a chicken wrap, just like you asked. Mm. Freddie, you know how you don't really like chocolate anymore? Mm -hmm. And that when you have Oreos, you don't like to eat them anymore? Well, look what our mummy has got you. Mummy has got you these. These are called golden Oreos. And these are really good because they've got no chocolate on them. They're just for you. What do you think of those? I'm just testing them. You're just testing them. So, Freddie, they're just for you because they have no chocolate on? No. Yay. Shall we have one with your milk? Yay. Yeah. What do you say to Mummy? Say thank you, Mummy. Thank you, Mummy. Good boy. Okay, then, are you going to try your biscuit? Oh. <laughs> what do you think? Good. Do you like them? Uh -huh. Yay! So we can buy golden Oreos for Freddie now. Oh, are you happy now that you can have Oreos again? Yeah, good boy. So soon after your biscuit and milk, it'll be bedtime. So do you want to say good night? Oh, where's it gone? Say good night. Good night. And will you see everybody tomorrow? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hi guys. So Madeline and Freddie are now in bed. Um, it is half past ten, and um. Rather than settling down and watching TV, um, I've had like this really ridiculous idea that um, before Christmas um, I'm going to like get all of the woodwork painted um, to freshen it up. Um, so I've done so much already this week um, and I'm just starting to do the kitchen end. So I'm just show you what I'm doing. So I'm doing this archway that leads into our kitchen and as you can see I've just started doing this bit and you can see how yellowy this is here and then you can see how white this is next to it because I've already done this bit so I kind of feel like I should have maybe done this a few weeks ago um but I was sort of focusing on getting all the presents sorted out and everything else so i have to be quite quiet because obviously i'm in the hallway and freddie's like just up there in bed um so yeah i'm just gonna crack on and get some more of this done i think probably the hardest part is making sure that freddie doesn't touch the paintwork that i have done um but yeah i've got my christmas tunes on um in the kitchen so i'm just gonna crack on with it now so this is the paint that I'm using. I don't use gloss. Um, I find that it just goes yellowy. Um, so I use the satin. And also, um, you can get this off your hands. Like I had like loads of it on the palm of my hand yesterday. And as you can see, obviously there's absolutely nothing there now. It just does come off straight away. Um, so that's really good. 
Um, I'm just using Wilco's paintbrushes and I bought a fresh pack today because the one that I used last night was quite battered. It's just these. They're just a Wilco functional range. I think they're like 175. Um, but yeah, so see, so I'm not going to, um, I'm not obviously going to vlog painting because People probably think our channel's a bit like watching paint dry anyway, so I really don't want to uh, vlog while I'm painting, but I just thought I'd let you guys know what I'm up to tonight. I hope everybody's having a far more interesting Wednesday than I am. Um, but I suppose this is kind of the best year, time of year for me to do painting and things like that because I've got something to focus on, like getting towards Christmas. Um, but yeah. I'll uh, check back in with you guys, hopefully not too long, because I don't want to have to spend ages doing this tonight, and I do want some time to chill out before I head up to bed. Hi guys, so I just thought I would check in quickly, um, it is currently 10 to 12, and I've just finished my painting for this evening. Um, I really did not want to get started tonight. Um, you know, obviously it was getting late, it was like after 10 when I got started. Um, and then I just turned around and looked at the amount of work that I'd already done um, and just seeing how nice and white and fresh um, the paintwork looked, it just inspired me to carry on tonight. Um, but I'm gonna be honest, I did not wanna get up off that sofa and go and get started tonight, but I'm really glad that I did. Um, so I've, done more than I wanted, than I thought I was going to do actually, um, because the panel that sits underneath the spindle, so that runs down the stairs, I've done half of that as well. You might be wondering why I've only done half of it, and um, well obviously I've got to think about how long it takes to dry. Now with it being a satin, it's very similar to a gloss, it takes a lot longer than emulsion to dry. Um, so for instance when we got up this morning, um, where I painted last night was still very tacky, um, and so I had to just get Madden and Freddie to be sort of extra careful and just said treat every surface as if it's just been painted. Um, which worked and then we went out of the house and we didn't come back until lunchtime and then it seemed all be dry, which was great. So the reason why I only did the top half of that panel that sort of sits under the spindles, like down the wall on the stairs, um, I'll show you next time. Um, but the reason why I only did the top half of it is because I was conscious that the time was getting on and obviously we'll be up in sort of seven, seven and a half hours. Um, so I knew if I did the bottom half of it then I was going to be fighting to keep him um, away from the kitchen, like the archway that leads into the kitchen that I showed you earlier and that one I thought I can cope with sort of keeping him, you know, sort of away from one but I'm going to struggle so and I'll get the top half of it done tonight. And then tomorrow night I can do the bottom half of that um, and then do a few more areas sort of Freddy level basically and just get started a bit earlier than tonight. Um, so yeah that's where I'm at with the painting. So a few of you are probably wondering why I've started painting and I don't just leave the painting to Jason when he gets home. Um, but it was my choice to start painting. Um, Jason, as he always says to me, oh, you're always busy, you're always busy. Um, and I know that if I said to him when he come home for the weekend, right, come on, we're gonna get painted, that he would quite happily pick up a paintbrush. But I want to spend quality time with Jason and Madeline and Freddie. Um, I don't want to be sort of wasting time, so to speak, doing DIY jobs. So because I'm here, I try my best to get things done and sorted so that we can have a nice relaxing weekend together um because i mean jason's working like dead hard i mean he does um, 12 shifts um in a row and then you know he's home um i mean obviously i'm here i know i'm running my own business and things like that but it's easier for me obviously to just get these jobs done bit by bit during the week um, and then that frees up our weekend um, and also to see the look on Jason's face when he comes home, um, you know, that's worth it. That, that's just worth its weight in gold to me for him to come through that door and just see that, like how much we've managed to achieve, you know, in the couple of weeks that he's been away. Um, I mean, this is not the first time that I've started painting and stuff like when he's away. Um, I remember one, one week, <laughs> um, it was, oh, 
it would have been two years ago it was um it was not long before we got the carpets fitted um throughout and he left on the monday or the sunday night whenever it was and but on that monday i just thought right i'm going to paint the living room this week so the room that i'm in now was like a horrible um like pale tan color well it kind of looked like i I don't know I'm I can't really describe it um just like this weird it wasn't magnolia and it wasn't a light brown it was something in between that it wasn't very nice at all um and then this wall so the other walls which are on our wall the same color um they were that and then the wall behind me here had this horrible uh, black and white swirly paper on so I just decided battery died <laughs> right so yeah um i ended up painting all this living room and um, when jason was away one week um freddie would have been about i don't know eight months something like that um but yeah so I, it's not my first time i've took my hand to paint and all like i got the kitchen started when jason was at work i just like to get things done um i don't like waiting for jason to have to come back and do it all he's working hard enough as it is i think um well guys i'm gonna end today's vlog here um i hope everybody has had a good day um big hello to all of our new subscribers and all of our current subscribers thank you so much for sticking with us i really do appreciate all of your comments your thumbs up um just everything you know i'm just feeling the love today guys thank you very much but for now guys good night sweet dreams and we'll see you all again very soon bye bye